Here's an overview, the solution consists of two parts, one. Update supplier generated UG data into SAP custom table through Signet APIs, the table consists of all the transactional data which supplier has provided to NIC. 2. During MIGO, GRN, compare supplier invoice number with updated custom table, and create parking entry, MIR7, automatically in SAP. If in case any difference persists between GRN quantity and NIC provided U quantity then we will create two parking entries automatically, one entry is for the quantity which is completely matched, and the other entry is for the differential quantity which we can consider as credit note debit note entry. In this demo video the U quantity is 90 kg and my go quantity is 10 kg, the system will identify the quantity difference, and it will create two parking entries, one is for matched quantity and the other is for differential quantity. This custom table stores location GSTINs, kind of master data table, where we need to add all the location GSTINs manually, it's one-time activity. Here you can see a custom program with input parameter as financial year, financial period and update date consuming Signet API to fetch supplier generated UG data or location wise and update it into custom table in SAP. The primary condition to fetch supplier generated UG data is that the location GSTIN custom table has to be up to date. The program will fetch you data only for those locations which are maintained in location GSTIN custom table. We can auto schedule this program on daily basis, every day it will pick location GSTINs from the custom table and fetch you data from NIC for the provided location GSTINs and update it into the SAP custom table. We have updated only one location GSTIN in custom table hence the program fetch data for that location only. As you can see the UG data updated in custom table. This is transaction table, where all the vendor invoices which we are fetching from NIC will be stored, and this table we will use for our further integration with GRN to auto-generate MIR7. In these two screens, the user is doing GRN, and in the next screens we will see that along with GRN, two parking entries will automatically be creating. You can see two parking entries created against single vendor invoice number, two parking entries created, because there was difference between GRN quantity and U quantity, so one parking entry created for matched quantity, and the other parking entry which is differential quantity. In the following screens we will see both the parking transaction screens.